Baby ibexes thrive on cliff edges, where their nimble hooves and fearless nature help them navigate steep terrain. Unaware of the nimble and formidable challenge awaiting in the wild terrain ahead, a curious fox sets off on a perilous pursuit. They need to focus as one slip could be their last. Sharp-eyed, the fox detects movement in the distance. Little does it know, the agile creatures it spotted are masters of the treacherous landscape. Finding hidden paths, it advances stealthily through the terrain. With a burst of energy, the fox initiates the pursuit. Gravity defied, it descends at an almost vertical angle. A risky manoeuvre that showcases the ibex's remarkable agility and survival instincts. The fox, fueled by determination, sustains a prolonged pursuit. In the end, the fox concedes, acknowledging the elusive nature of its prey. Today's pursuit leaves the fox empty-handed. There could be deadly repercussions if a conflict concludes with one of the combatants falling down a cliff. Now that we're ready to dive in, let's discover what sets Ibex fights apart. The ibex, sometimes called the alpine ibex, is a free-range goat species indigenous to Europe's lofty alpine regions. Males compete to determine who gets to mate with a female when she's ready. They were supplanted by their rivals. The most important thing is to gain ground. The male's skulls are designed to withstand a lot of impact. They're on equal footing. If an ibex becomes unbalanced, the fight might go on for an hour. Dangerous injury or death may result from a fall from a tremendous height. Because of this, their conflicts are about more than simply power. They are also for survival. One of the males tragically loses control and plummets from more than 6,000 feet in the air. Intense and dangerous confrontations between ibex common. Here, a fall from a cliff may be the result of the smallest slip. Males compete head to head to see who can handle the most punishment. Despite the risks, their unconventional fighting style demonstrates their resilience and will to live. The objective is to seize control by throwing the other off their death game. Even on the most precipitous cliffs, they are able to keep their balance because to their powerful hind legs. The ability to time one's strikes perfectly is crucial for an ibex to throw off its opponent. This demonstrates how seriously they take the importance of ensuring their own survival and the success of their offspring. The Snow Leopard. With one goal in mind, a master of these tough mountains stalks the rocky landscape. To locate food for its offspring, spotting a mother mountain goat and her offspring as they go side by side. The small goat runs scared away as the chase begins. The speed and dexterity of the snow leopard nevertheless 
are astounding. A ferocious battle breaks out when the snow leopard succeeds in capturing the young goat. The hunt comes to a sudden halt though, as the victim leaps and runs into the river, escaping from the predator. Despite its disappointment, the snow leopard continues its relentless hunt for food. Another chance encounter with a herd of deer follows shortly thereafter, including a member who is both youthful and naive, but full of excitement about what's to come. The snow leopard's leap is a breathtaking demonstration of its untamed agility and speed. Despite the fact that the juvenile deer heroically tries to escape by jumping from the hilltop, it is ultimately unsuccessful. The tireless pursuit of prey by the snow leopard culminates in a kamikaze jump. In a breathtaking finale, the snow leopard's fearless display pays off as it mercilessly captures its prey. Making sure its young have the food they need. An unrelenting northerly hunger compels a grizzly bear to make its home in the vast expanse of these plains. Continually looking out for possible food sources, as the bear beholds a magnificent herd of caribou, a spark of excitement lights up its eyes. The primal pursuit intensifying as they approach nearer with each step. The sheer number of animals in the herd is overwhelming, especially the adults, who are able to outrun the bear on foot. Their evasiveness is a result of their speed. Nevertheless, a significant development occurs in the midst of the dogged chase. A weary juvenile caribou gives up to its limits as another youngster courageously takes the lead. Using a fortunate turn of events to redirect the bear's focus. Time stands still for no hunter, and the alert bear quickly seizes a new opportunity as they emerge unharmed from the terrifying event, a gorgeous deer temptingly close by. The bear attacks its unsuspecting prey with unwavering resolve, moving with measured precision. As the bear devours its victim, the decision is quickly made. Enjoy your meal. The mightiest and biggest wolves on earth are preparing to go on a hunt in northern Canada. The fact that there are 25 of them indicates that the game they are pursuing is difficult. The largest land mammals in North America, these bison are significantly larger than their southern relatives. The fierce rivalry between the local wolves and bison has molded both species into the most formidable of their respective species. Their opportunity to surprise the bison in the forest has gone, but the wolves are drawing near. Now that they're out in the open, their prey have gathered together for protection. The wolves' chances of success in hunting will increase if they coordinate their efforts.
In an effort to divide and conquer the herd, they encircle it. The bison, however, are hostile and armed. An immature bison is left trailing. Here, the pack stepped it up a notch, trying to rush the herd in the hopes of sparking a stampede that would separate one of the smaller animals. As a protective measure, bison will circle their young with their horns facing outward. If the wolves want to break ranks, they need a bison. However, this vicious predator is making life difficult for the young one who was angry. The bison start to freak out as the other wolf decides to join his pack. And the whole herd turns its attention to the back. An immature bison is left trailing. All the way down to this yearling, the wolves are dwarfed. The herds were fixated on his possible escape. The wolves were fortunate. After a few days of sustenance from the kill, the pack will have to pick up the pursuit again, near the planet's freezing poles. Efforts to stay alive are all go. We will hunt as one. Separated, we fall. The benefits of teaming up with other hunters much exceed the dangers of going it alone. Coexisting in harmony, bald eagles and bears have numerous communal meals as they forage for food in their lush surroundings. The noble eagle and the fearsome bear both take turns caring for their young ones. Freshwater fish, which is juicy and flavorful, is one of their favorite foods. The flying predator is far more adept at pursuing its prey in water than its terrestrial relative. The huge animal climbed out of the water and was soon approaching the tree where the nest was sitting. All the while, the watchful bird watched its every move. There is no way you can go so near to the nest, quickly disregarding the critical situation from above. The eagle replied by surprising the invader with a strike from behind. The massive invader kept moving toward the nest tree, intent on climbing, despite the constant cries coming from above. The ground dweller continued to exchange rebellious roars with the avian guardian until he reached the edge of the nest. When that happened, the airborne sentinel started attacking the determined invader non-stop. The bear's unflinching stance set off a contest of dogged determination to determine who could hold their ground the longest. Even after hours of non-stop fighting, Despita taking the beating, the tenacious beer fout off the mighty eagle. 
with lightning speed and claws as sharp as swords. The ruler of the sky strikes fear into the hearts of lesser aviators. It slits a duck's throat in an instant. The synchronized accuracy and exceptional vision of a squadron of bald eagles propels them on their daily hunt. It leaps from the sky with unprecedented speed to capture a swimming duck covering kilometers like a guided missile. It failed miserably on its first try. While the weaker birds see their fellow eagles fall victim one by one, unintentionally creating an opportunity for another eagle to take advantage of unsuccessful attempts. In the face of an unrelenting assault from the vicious raptors, a mother makes the courageous decision to take refuge with her defenseless young. Some ducks use diving as a tactic, expertly holding their breath for astounding periods of up to two hours. As the defenseless ducks stand there, unable to protect themselves, watching in horror, there is a royal return of the eagle to its own family. Parenti lizards Colossal beasts of strength and rage inhabiting the parched Australian bush. Along with the infamous mulga snake, this fearsome creature shares a hostile environment. The flashing tongue of the parenti lizard serves multiple purposes. including smelling, tracking animal tracks, and navigating its surroundings. A fearsome predator in the reptile realm, the Mulga snake, is immune to the venom of other snakes. The intriguing predator-prey dynamic is further enhanced by the fact that its adversary, the parenti lizard, possesses the same immunity. This reptile can cover a lot of ground very quickly. It is common for reptiles to fight for survival by biting their prey repeatedly until it is immobilized and then subdued. Finally, the lizard was able to get away from the snake because its resolve was stronger than its hunger. The mongoose relies on its social structure and the might of its numbers to ward off any dangers. Baboons are social animals that hunt in groups, using their combined brain power and muscular strength to overwhelm predators and protect themselves from danger. In an effort to avoid a possible fight with the larger primates, the baboons took flight the second they spotted the mongoose. The mongoose's escape attempt was thwarted when a baboon saw them and charged at them.
As the swifter baboon cornered one of the mongooses, the other mongooses saw they had no choice but to fight back. They relied on their numbers to tame and dominate the menace, biting its hand. A leopard watched as the mongoose and baboon clashed. The leopard was taken aback by their bravery and admiration. The mongooses managed to control the baboon, but then they made a critical error. Their paths diverged. While some took cover in burrows, others climbed trees and then dispersed in all directions. Although the leopard couldn't reach the burrows or mongooses, the others had sneaked up on the leopard's preferred area. Out of nowhere, the leopard snatched one of the mongooses. Even though others work hard to get what they need, a mother possum's house with her young in the nest could make them easy prey. Once again, the malevolent observer cautiously approaches the mother's youngsters. only to catch them off guard with an assault. In her frantic defense of her babies, she bites him viciously as he leaps into the nest. The children were rescued thanks to the mother's unwavering determination. He needs to find other ways to eat. Some mothers shield their unborn children from harm, but failing now will result in your demise. She has eggs that are being sought after by both the opportunistic lizard and the cobra. By growing larger, they hope to frighten one another. After the monitor baits the cobra into backing off, the latter retaliates with a second attack. But the award goes to the lizard. Mother Crocodile scurries to rescue her young, but it's already too late. When she gets back, she sees that the monitors have devoured her eggs and all the others. His companion was caught. The mother crocodile sees them in a fit of wrath because the first monitor bolted at the sight of them. Because of its resilience, persistence and viciousness, the honey badger has become notorious. It will attack practically any other species with ferocity and fearlessness when it can't get away. The honey badger gets its name from its love of honey, and it's one of the few animals that can fearlessly enter a beehive. Its thick fur coat protects it well from bee stings, but its face is still vulnerable. The honey badger realizes the agony was worth it after tasting honey. The honey badger watches a neighboring turtle with its powerful jaws and curved claws for signs of movement. Honey cannot satisfy its hunger on its own. 
Honey badgers are so determined to get to the turtle's juicy meat that they will stop at nothing to get so. Badgers are notoriously obstinate. And this honey badger gets a tasty treat for being so determined. Even though it tries to hide among the thorns, this honey badger's hunger for rodents never subsides. In spite of this, the honey badger keeps its hold on its victim. Until the very end, the mouse stubbornly holds on to the honey badger's tongue in an act of defiance. In the end, though, the honey badger comes out on top. <laughs> 